which is you've, you've obviously you've been praised massively for the effects in Monsters and, I, and how amazing it looks and the production values. But I think it's actually quite an interesting story. Well, it's a, it's a very good story told very well. Do you ever think maybe, do you ever feel a little bit aggrieved that people are focusing on the production values and how, my, how you've made it look rather than the story you've told? I don't mind really. I mean, it's, I've, I've had this a long time in terms of when you do visual effects, that's pretty much people can't quite get over the fact, oh, you did that from your bedroom type reaction. And, and, and so for me, it was like, obviously we set out to try and make the best film we could. So it felt like, in a weird way, like the worst thing someone could say when you left the cinema was the effects were amazing. You know, you really want them to say, I enjoyed the story, or I was moved, or I cared about the characters, all that sort of nonsense. But um, how surreal is this? This is bizarre. I'm, this is the closest I've ever been to a director, and it's very odd in terms of just huddling. It's like we're in a scrum or something. It's the closest I've ever been to anyone famous as well. Hey, this is, and yeah, normally on TV. I'm as thrown as anybody else here. I really like feel like I'm out of my depth coming to something like this, but... Offer them a job now, see what they say. Yeah. Must be a role for, in Godzilla for three guys from the in-between us. They're making a movie, aren't they? I think they're like right and nearly finished it or something. As far as I know, it's actually shot and it's ready to roll. But it's, yeah, on the subject of shot and ready to roll, got a date for Godzilla yet? We don't do dates quite like that. But, yeah, there is a... It's all going full steam ahead. Uh, it's in development. Um, so, fingers crossed, it'll all happen really fast. And The concept art that was online about this time last year... Is that actually from Godzilla, this production of Godzilla, or is that sort of erroneous art that shouldn't have been published? Which art is it? Because well, there's, there's quite a few. There was a sculpture and some drawings and things like that. Depends what it is. I mean, there's nothing specifically that's for the film, but, but I think there was a piece of art that was created for Comic-Con that was just mainly for a T-shirt, I believe. It wasn't, oh, this is going to be the movie. It was more a case of like just getting excited about the idea of Godzilla. It's not nothing like specifically for the movie itself. Thank you very much. Hey, cheers.